Hi everyone! So you might have guessed that Winnie the Witch is one of my favourite storybook characters and I'm going to read you another Winnie the Witch story. This one's called Winnie Flies Again and it's also written by Valerie Thomas and Corky Paul. Winnie the Witch always travelled by broomstick. It was a wonderful way to travel. Winnie would jump onto her broomstick and Wilbur would jump onto her shoulder and they would zoom through the sky. There were no traffic lights, no traffic jams, just the empty sky. Well, that was how it used to be. But just lately, the sky had become rather crowded. Last week, Wilbur didn't see a helicopter. Ugh, Winnie didn't see a helicopter and Wilbur lost two whiskers. Uh-oh. His whiskers have gone. There they go. Do, 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 do. Oops. The week before that, she didn't see a hang glider. And Wilbur's tail got bent. Oops. And the week before that, a very tall building suddenly got in her way. And Wilbur lost a clump of fur. Uh oh, she's flown straight into the building. <laughs> there she's hanging upside down. The sky is too dangerous, Wilbur, said Winnie. We'll have to try something else. So she took out her wand. She waved it and she shouted. Can you remember what does a witch say? Abracadabra. And her broomstick turned into a bicycle. It was very slow and very hard to pedal. And then a pond got in Winnie's way. She looked, oh, she should look where she's going, croaked a frog. Oh, a bicycle is worse than a broomstick, Wilbur, said Winnie. We'll have to try something else. So she took out her wand, she waved it, and she shouted, Abracadabra! And her bicycle turned, turned into a skateboard. My goodness, the skateboard was fast, but it was hard to steer and impossible to stop. Winnie was stopped by an ice cream seller. Oh no, she's just rid rid she's ridden straight into the ice cream seller. Can't you see where you're going? He shouted. A skateboard is worse than a bicycle, Wilbur, said Winnie. We'll have to try something else. So she took out her wand, she waved it and she shouted, Abracadabra! And her skateboard turned into a horse and they trotted slowly down the path. This is much better than bicycles or skateboards, said Winnie. But what do you think is going to happen? Look, here's a branch and look there. Ooh! But Winnie didn't see the low branch. This time Winnie didn't say anything because she was too busy hanging from the tree. Slowly and carefully Winnie climbed down from the tree. I think we'll walk home, Wilbur said Winnie. Oh dear, look at her foot there. Caught under the root of the tree. Silly Winnie. She needs to look more carefully, doesn't she? They limped slowly along the road. It was a very, very slow way to travel. But at least it was safe. Or is it? Look there, there's a big sign saying danger and Wilbur's going, stop Winnie! Goodness me, look there. And then until when he stepped into a hole and tumbled ooh, deep down underground. There she is. Oh, no. I think I need a cup of tea, when he said. Oh, dear. Her day is not going very well, is it? When he climbed out of the tunnel and went into a shop. A cup of tea and a muffin, please, she said, and a saucer of milk for my cat. Does this look like a tea shop? Look there. Look at all the glasses in the background. Do you think it's a tea shop or a coffee shop? I don't think so. Hmm. We don't sell cups of tea or muffins, said the shop lady. And we don't have sources of milk. But I think I can help you. What do you think Winnie might need instead of a cup of tea and a saucer of milk? She sold Winnie a pair of spectacles. Look, she's got a pair of glasses. Now, what do spectacles or glasses help you to do? They help you to 
C. Now, Winnie and Wilbur travel everywhere by broomstick. And it's a wonderful way to travel. So she obviously doesn't bump into things anymore because now she can see where she's going. Have a good night, everybody. Sleep tight. Bye-bye.